2018 Jaguar XF review. The Jaguar XF sees some significant improvements for 2018, including a new, less expensive base trim and a standard turbocharged engine that replaces the previous year's turbodiesel engine. Still, Jaguar's convoluted, dated technology relegates the XF to the bottom third of a very competitive class. New for 2018 New base trim is less expensive than last year's. Al new four-cylinder gasoline engine is standard. Wagon body style now available. New safety features added to driver assistance package. Pros and cons. Comfortable, roomy cabin. One of the largest cargo spaces in the class. Well-rounded selection of peppy engines. Superb fuel economy. Portions of infotainment system are overly complicated. Navigation system doesn't work consistently. The Jaguar XF is a decent luxury midsize car, but it isn't great. Its new standard turbocharged power train is fuel efficient and the optional diesel engine provides a good combination of performance and fuel economy. A wagon version dubbed the Sport Brake is also new for 2018, it is powered by a highly praised supercharged V6 engine. Where the XF suffers is in some areas of likely importance to luxury shoppers, the infotainment system, for example, is difficult to use and can be distracting to employ while driving. Passenger space and predicted reliability are also merely average, preventing the XF from standing out among better overall rivals. The XF's starting price is almost $7,000 more than the class average, but it provides a relative bargain against some direct rivals that retail for more than $50,000. The XF is polished and elegant enough to be a respectable value in this class. On the other hand, it is light on standard features. You'll have to spend extra money to get treats like leather seats, navigation, and advanced driver assistance features. For a few thousand dollars more, consider high red vehicles like the BMW 5 Series or Mercedes Benz A Class. The 5 Series among the best in the class for overall performance, with powerful engines and agile handling. The Mercedes, meanwhile, offers a truly elegant cabin experience with tons of features. Whether you favor a lower purchase price, improved fuel economy, or brisker acceleration, one of the 2018 XF's four available engines will work for you. On the highway, there's more cabin noise than you may expect from a Jaguar especially when powered by the diesel engine, but it is still relaxing. The pleasing suspension modes range from comfortably supple to athletic and snappy. Four different engines are available in the 2018 XF, all of which are paired to an 8-speed automatic transmission. The standard 25 tons engine is turbocharged 2.0-liter four-cylinder with a 247-horsepower rating. Its fuel economy is one of the highest in the class at 25 miles per gallon in the city and 34 miles per gallon on the highway. You get even better fuel economy with the optional diesel engine, 31 miles per gallon in the city and 34 on the highway. The 20D turbodiesel four-cylinder adds $1,500 to the price and is rated at 180 horsepower. Two supercharged V6 engines are also available a 340-horsepower version available in every trim, and a 380-horsepower version reserved only for the XFS and the Sport Brake models. The smaller engines are quite capable of handling highway merging and overtaking with ease. That said, most test drivers prefer the supercharged V6 engines. They aren't as throaty as some of the robust offerings from competitors but they are thrilling enough to satisfy the occasionally rebellious jaunt. 
Riding in the 2017 Jaguar XF is just as pleasant as you'd expect it to be. The cabin is richly swathed in premium materials, with lots of ways to customize your interior, and the seats in both rows are roomy enough for adults. The technology is a bit hitormous, and the base model is a little light on standard features. Both of these issues knock down the XF's interior score. Both the front and back seats are roomy and comfortable enough for adults. The cushions are fairly supportive, though some people may feel they are a touch too firm. LuxTech Jaguar's synthetic leather upholstery and 10-way adjustable front seats come standard. There are multiple upgraded leather options available, including grain leather, to tone color combinations, and contrast stitching. Other seating options include 16-way adjustable front seats, heated and cooled front seats, heated rear seats, a heated steering wheel, a power sunshade for the rear window, and manual sunshades for the rear side windows. The back seats fold down with a 402040 split in all but the base model. For securing child safety seats, there are tether anchors mounted on all three rear seats and lower anchors on the outboard seats. Jaguar uses its in-control touch infotainment system in the XF. This system comes standard with an 8-inch touch screen, an 11-speaker Meridian sound system, Bluetooth connectivity, and HD radio. Within the interface, the basic controls like media settings are mostly easy to use. When you dive deeper into functions like navigation available as an upgrade and phone connectivity, the interface can sometimes lag or freeze. Redundant buttons on the steering wheel and below the screen give quick, easy to access to some climate and audio settings. Additional standard features include dual zone automatic climate control, push button start, and emergency brake assist. The base XF doesn't include as many standard features as some rivals, but there are plenty of upgrades available to remedy this. Options include a 10-inch touch screen, a 12.3-inch driver display, navigation, a 17-speaker Meridian surround sound system, a Wi-Fi hotspot, and Quadzone automatic climate control. Safety upgrades such as adaptive cruise control with stop-start functionality, a 360-degree camera system, adaptive headlights, lane keep assist, lane departure warning, a driver condition monitor, blind spot monitoring, traffic sign recognition and intelligent speed limiter, a head-up display, rear cross-traffic monitoring, and parking sensors on the front, sides, and rear are also available. The XF has the largest trunk among luxury midsize cars, measuring 19.1 cubic feet. In all but the base trim, you can lay the 402040 split folding rear seats down to create more room. Most find the trunk to be sizable enough to carry even bulky items, like large suitcases and golf clubs. The available hands-free trunk lid is convenient when your hands are full. Thank you